for any genre, what is mystery in a story and why is it necessary? There's a certain amount of mystery that is necessary in every story, I believe. And that is because we have to get the audience asking questions. There has to be something they don't know. There's a classic old saying in Hollywood, give me what I want and expect, but give it to me in a different way that I've never seen before. And this is, of course, very common uh, in what we see. We see one film or one story or one television show that has a great deal of success, and then we see lots of people trying to replicate the way that that film or television show executed that mystery, the way that they got people uh, asking questions within themselves. We see others try and replicate that. But I believe that mystery, in one sense, speaks to what it means to be human. Since the beginning of the human experience, we have long, long asked ourselves, is there something beyond us? Is there something bigger than us? When there's even the smallest element of mystery in a story, it speaks to that craving we have to know if there's something bigger, if there's something beyond, if this is it, or if there's perhaps a world just beyond us that's even more real than what we're experiencing right here. What are ways you like to build mystery in a story? I believe that mystery is built in a story through raising the stakes in a story. Oftentimes, uh, storytellers will, will attempt to build mystery in a story by pulling the blocks of the audience's understanding out from under them as the story progresses. That certainly is one approach. However, audiences can become quite frustrated by that and perhaps get more confused as the story goes forward with that approach. So I believe a more effective approach is to actually raise the story in moving towards mystery. How do we raise the stakes in a story? Well, there's a couple of ways we can do that. One is to compress time. Certainly when there's a deadline for something that has to be done, uh, that raises the stakes and the character suddenly doesn't have as much time to complete this task as possible, which means they're going to become reliant on things perhaps beyond themselves. Because what they have accessible to them is not necessarily going to be enough to accomplish what they need to accomplish. So there's going to become a reliance on something bigger than themselves. In the same vein, another way to raise the stakes in a story is to compress space. The, the, the place the story uh, takes place in may be one way to do that, but it's really the walls of the story start slowly moving in on the character. And again, the character is going to have to look for something beyond themselves in order to find a way out of this. Perhaps the journey will be within. Perhaps it's something within themselves they didn't know was there. Other times, and this is something Joseph Campbell talked about, Campbell talked about the idea of salvation from without. In other words, um, a character reappearing in the story or coming out of nowhere seemingly to help and bring a solution that we didn't see possible. This also is, I think, speaks to our desire for when we find ourselves in the tightest of situations, believing that maybe somewhere out there something is going to come in and save us and provide that solution that we've been looking for. Is every protagonist a detective? Every protagonist shares qualities of a detective. They are searching for something. It may be that they're searching for something that exists in the world, and it may be a very external search, and it may be that they're searching for something within themselves. 
It may be that they're trying to locate something within themselves that they know is there, but they've never been able to access it. It may be that they're trying to search for something within themselves that others have told them is there, but they've never been able to see it for themselves. Whatever it is, they're going to need clues in order to get there. In the same way that a detective needs clues in order to find what they are looking for, those clues rarely come without another character bringing them to light. It's so rare that a character will stumble upon clues themselves. Usually clues come to the character through other characters. Not always, but most of the time, it will be through introducing another character's energy or presence into the story that suddenly a new path opens up. A new possibility opens up. And when we find those paths and those possibilities, it begins to help us in solving the overall mystery that the character is trying to solve. So in a sense, yes, every protagonist is a detective, though what they search for may be radically different and how they go about searching for it certainly will be different.